What are good and bad carbohydrates and fats? What are long and short carbs? The difference between long and short carbs is the amount of time they take to reach the bloodstream. Long carbohydrates take longer to enter the bloodstream as they are digested slowly owing to their complex nature. In other words, they are consumed whole without processing. On the contrary, short carbs splint their way into the bloodstream because they do not require much digestion. They are usually the processed forms of carbohydrates. Short carbs also do not last long in the bloodstream, unlike long carbs. What are good and bad carbs? Depending on their effects on insulin, carbohydrates can be termed as good or bad. Good carbs do not lead to insulin spikes. They take longer to digest, hence gradually enter the bloodstream. Insulin spikes can lead to insulin resistance, blocking the entry of glucose into cells and depriving them of energy. Consequently, glucose left roaming in the bloodstream is converted to fat for storage. Bad carbs cause insulin spikes. They get digested fast and end up in the bloodstream with gusto, forcing the pancreas to produce a lot of insulin to deal with the sudden glucose upsurge. Besides causing insulin resistance, bad carbs are linked to heart disease, cancer and type 2 diabetes. What are good and bad fat? Many people condemn fats as a whole. However, there are good and bad fats. Mono and polyunsaturated fatty acids are considered good fats. Most plant-based fats are good fats. They contain no cholesterol and therefore healthy for the heart. Bad fats refer to the class of fats called trans fats and saturated fats. They are mainly found in margarine or animal fat. They contain cholesterol, which is a risk factor for cardiovascular diseases and obesity.